Uh, good evening YouTube, this is also b 200 Productions with another video for you today. And today we're going to continue our Portuguese campaign of 1143 mode, and that I read very fast. But yes, today we're going to continue what we last, uh, last left off. Yes, that's it. So, on the previous part, we had conquered Murcia, and we were about to move out this army to Valencia to completely execute any last remaining power of of Castile on the west side of the coast. Since we got uh, Castile cut off, we have to maintain that uh, cut by defeating this army which is threatening Cuenca, and we have to completely save and protect Burgos from every consecutive attack from, from Navarre because undoubtedly they will not stop until we are all Dead. But anyway, we shall continue. So yeah, um, there's not much left to do in this part, so as you can probably tell. I'm gonna move this army here so that we can reinforce it very quickly. We're going to completely disband these mercenaries because we're going to lose a lot of money because I've been checking, and it's quite a grave situation indeed. We have to kill this uh, this heretic because the heresy problem is growing really, 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 really fast. I need to deal with it shortly. And give me just one second because I have to, I forgot to deal with one thing that can probably kill this entire campaign and making me have to do uh, a video once again. And I do not want that shit. So yeah, I'll be right back. So we are, we are back. I had to completely shut down Steam because I already recorded a bit of this part. And I had to like delete it all because the freaking event started on Steam and it completely made the game crash and that freaking bullshit. But yeah, we're going to continue on. All that, so we have to completely protect Burgos at all costs. As I've already told that, said that before, and now we're going to defend Cuenca, and now we're going to end this part, this uh, this turn, right the way. Yes, my lord. And maybe. Yeah, okay, so we're recruiting a bit of men there, but we're not recruiting any men here. I'm gonna make some some forces round. We're going to end this part and I'm going to show you this uh, end turn phase. Because now I'm not going to spare you. Uh, only sometimes when I when I see that I need a little bit more time and this can be some time consuming shit. So yeah. I'm going to continue it and um, so Kingdom of Navarre is moving with uh, the navy there with some agents as well and that uh, heretic is trying to escape and we're going to get some new flesh and a new chapter house in Murcia. Evora is ready to upgrade and I am proud of my fellow Evoranians or whatever you like to call them. And we got a nice fleet coming on. We got now three generals ready to be ready to be used in war. And this bishop is going to try his best to kill this bastard and he did. For Lord in Christ we will kill everybody that does not comply. I'm kidding. But yes, but serious. But anyway. Yes, my See if we can defeat this fleet. And we can! And it sunk down to the ground, yes. Prepare to board and engage! Yeah! A glorious triumph! Right, so that, uh, yes. that bastard seemed to have run away. Oh, he's dead now. Oh, he's dead. Our fleet is and another victory! Yeah! Prepare to board and engage! Very good. A glorious triumph! Your orders? Yes, my lord. Yes. Yes, my lord. Uh, but Very good. Leaving the rest of the fleet, my lord. Um, so they're moving up with this army here, it seems. Mm -hmm. See if we can kill this princess of theirs. And there we go, he's dead. She's dead. 
And we're going to move up with this army right here. I'm gonna scout up this army. It's quite a nice army that they have here. And there is still a Granatine Diplomat? I have no idea why. But yes, it does. I'm gonna move this bishop here. Um, this priest move it up here. And since we're losing a bit of money, well, I'm quite getting worried about it. We're going to start and not be as neglectful for our provinces as we as I was. Right, this is going to upgrade. No, stay right there. Stay there. Good. Salamanca, Zamora, Coria, Badajoz. Oh, there are some buildings to build there. Some buildings to build. Building. Oh, Murcia. We can retrain these bastards and we can build something next turn. And we got a new general! That's amazing! And we're going to protect this army right away! Completely destroy this army right now! And the city has been protected! And they're still at large. Very good. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna end this turn once again. There we go, this priest is coming here. Been neglecting my my faction. Because I already have so many units around, so many agents, so many things to do that just completely impossible to handle them all and now they're moving up uh, Navarre mm -hmm. what's the honorable yeah why right not the turn report lost some money earthquake and Faj and no and I lost a freaking merchant Did that just blimey bullshit Right, Vincent Priest. Mm hmm. Fair, do, do, be, do be. Oh, in Murcia. Can build some farm. And, re and retrain these bastards. Oh, when, he, when we have these two, we can probably send them a few men with them. Move out. Good. And then bring them this man and bring them to Surya. They're now moving with this uh, with this Navarrese force around. See if we can kill this bastard. And no, but we will try next turn. I'm gonna siege these bastards. Oh, no. Ah, it doesn't seem that we can. Alright, so let's check uh, Check the armies of Castillo nearby. Oh, we got a nice army here. Very good. Awesome. And uh, we're gonna end this turn once again. Oh wait, what we need here? A church, and it, and it, and it. And, uh, maybe give them some money. Yeah, around 3k would be nice. Of course, good hey. it has been a pleasure. And no, uh, it didn't increase in anything. Yes. Yes, my lord. Very good. In course now, my lord. Well, we need to cut on some expenses because it seems that our production is going very bad at this time. Yes, my lord. Geraldo Barroso is going to die, or Geraldo Barroso in Portuguese, if you want to say it correctly. Got a small rebellion force there. Oviedo. 
Yeah, we can build this shit. Why not? Can we train some units? Finally. In Burgos, nothing. Nothing. To Ledu as well, no. What about Cuenca? No. And this turn again. And that army is finally moving up. And this priest is finally moving up as well. And that's very the suspension is killing me on what is going to happen. I have no idea. But it seems that uh, once the and did it just go directly into my massive army there? And uh, Enric de Lima, benefactor adoption. Why not? <gasps> Suppression of the Templars! Oh no! On Friday, October 13th, 1307, the King Philip IV of France ordered the Templar Grandmaster Jacques de Molay and scores of other French Templars to be simultaneously arrested. The Templars were charged with numerous blasphemy. Oh no, with numerous heresies and tortures and torture to extract false confessions of blasphemy. Confessions, despite having been obtained under Duris, caused a scandal in Paris. After more bullying from Philip, Pope Clement then issued the Bull Pastoralis Preeminente on November 22, 1307, which instructed all Christian monarchs in Europe to arrest all temporary seize their assets. Pope Clement for permanent to determine the pet and blah 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 blah. blah. And so Portugal, um, Portugal and some other nations, but Portugal with more, um, um, yes, yes, my with, with better conditions, if you can say that, um, welcomed the Templars and everything, and thus created the Order of Christ. Um, the Order of Christ still exists uh, today. And I think that now we can recruit um, Order of Christ Knights. I think. Let me check. Wait a second, don't tell me that I lost all of my Templars. I lost all of my Templars. Yes, oh no! <laughs> God will be with us, men. Yeah, dude, you're Without fun! <laughs> But I lost all my Templars. And no, god damn it! I lost all my Templars, so I have to wait for. Ready to Yes, there's money in this, my lord. So I'll have to freaking wait to get a uh, Order of Christ chapter house. That is bullshit. Why can't they just? Why couldn't they just put it as a freaking like just upgraded or something to, yes, to yes, Order of the Christ? We shall continue tomorrow, my Let's see. No, they're they're all gone. No, 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 no. And I lost the units. I lost. It's gone. Oh, okay. Let's see. <coughs> some economic buildings. Public order, very nice. And so we have now to wait for freaking um. I'm going to siege this uh, place. No, we're going to have to wait for a bit. Yes, Lord. Uh, this army completely betrayed uh, Spain. Seems. And now we're going through this road up ahead and uh, and try to cut off any stranglers that we encounter in that area. Very good. Anderson as well. Bring up with those already right, then. Uh, no, we're going to continue them with there and then put a general with them. Why didn't I put just now? I have no idea, but I trust my captain's loyalties because they're all very pious and all that, and that's very good. My lord, they're Ooh. engaging us! No! Clear the feet! No! The fleet is under attack! 
Crew to beat. Damn it. So we lost all of these battles, but we will. We will reunite them. The Order of Christ, thank God. After the Templar Order's suppression by Pope Clement in 1312, the Portuguese king set about creating a new order for the displaced knights in Israel. He instituted the Order of the Christ, and the Pope approved this order by a papal bull Aed Ea Ex Kibi. Kibush. Kibi. Oh, fuck, I suck at that. They're the most advanced, actually. Are you kidding me? Fosum Nish, where are you? Oh, another general! Jesus Christ! And you're in the city. With the best general I can appoint. Part of the source I can, I can trust you enough to bring the final destruction. Still have space for a few more units indeed. So I can finally. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Sorry about that, guys. So be able to make Christ Knights probably in two turns or something. Yes. Um, space. Yes. One more unit. Portuguese Knights and attack Soria. We march to battle. Probably attack. Um, Valencia next turn because they're probably already a bit depleted or depleted enough. Right, everything is going good. Some more ports. And it doesn't seem that we're going to be able to enter the gunpowder age. Yeah, but it doesn't seem so. Kind of disappointing. Right, that we're going to end this turn again. Oh wait, we're going to bring this army up here. Five hundred men, ransom rejected. Completely losing too many men on the front. That makes some mercenaries lose some money, but it's okay. Okay, finally! Jesus! A victory on the shores, indeed. Alright, let's check. So they're now going to blockade our port, it seems. So advanced section is us. Pretty good. Cathedrals everywhere, if people be happy. Want our people to be happy indeed. Yes. Closing to engage. Clear victory! Yay! Our fleet is victorious! Yes, my lord. No one can possibly Don't contend against now, the navies of Portugal. Yes. Yes, my lord. Prepare to board your orders. Closing to engage. Clear victory. Yeah. Victory. Yes, my lord. Your orders. Uh, we train these two ships. Worthy admiral, fine officer, indeed, and fine he is. Some trade here. Salamanca has nothing to build. Curia. Yes, Lord. This is where we shall meet. Very good. So we can make a man of the hour. The no men of the hour. We have no men of the they hour throughout this campaign. We had no captain turn pr getting promoted into general or anything like that. It's kind of disappointing. Missed out on some features. I I relied so much on my generals because I was afraid of of the captains betraying me constantly, yes, as it did once in a campaign of mine. Um, that like I just don't trust the captains enough. Seems here that they're they that they can be trusted. At least trusted enough for a few for a few marches and all that. 
in church, everywhere, make people happy. Let's see if we can kill this dude. No, we cannot. 361 men dead. Ransom accepted it seems. Thanks, thank you for the many. Yes, Lord. Treating cruel and cunning, it seems. Noble Lord. Yes, Lord. We march. Yes. March. Going yes. to able to attack Surya next turn. Seize it for ourselves. And, and this officer. will probably God's be really the end for Castile. Is it time to assault your orders, Noble One? Of course, my lord. Orders, your majesty. Bringing our troops to yes. Another army ready. It's not a full stack, but it'll have to do. And final turn before uh, before we end this part. And no battles this part. It's been really a while. Bef mm, really a while that I didn't do. Uh, oh no, he did. He did. So sorry. He did. But anyway, um, it's really been a long time since I did a part where there are no um, no battles and all that. Yes. What can you do? What can you do? A glorious trial. Yes, my lord. Closing to a Shouldn't have come here. Our fleet is victorious. How can they how can they like escape? So fast and so accurate and all that. Yes. It's like bullshit your orders? everywhere. Yes. Your orders? Blockading trade to this port. Burgu. Yep, happiness, happiness everywhere. Orders. Oh no, we didn't put a freaking general here. What the hell? Yes. No. Oh Christ, knights! How oh, I love thee. There's so many generals here, and we and I didn't put one there. How could I be so blind? Um. Leaving the army, my lord. Yes. You can go here. My lord. Let me strike, my lord. This is like bullshit. Noble lord. Whole new level. God will be with us, men. To battle. Two, 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 two. Let's check. Mercenaries and then the king, I think. No, it's a family member, but he is quite good. Jesus Christ! How he did? How did he get? So I think I can defeat them. And if I can't, well, have another army coming, so yeah. Um, but this has to be left out for another part, because this one is already getting too big. And I hope you enjoyed this part, guys. Um, hope you also enjoyed that map making video I made for Stronghold 2. Um, you thought that I was like forgetting. Uh, about my Stronghold 2 series that I promise you guys. No, but it's all false. I've been making it, but it's coming very slowly and all that. Um, but it, it, it will come, don't you worry. It will come and it will probably um, come really a long time before a Stronghold Crusader 2 comes out. But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this part. Comment, rate, or subscribe wherever you like, and I'll see you guys next part.